today we are doing standing abs and do you want to know the best thing about standing abs the best thing about standing abs is you can do it anywhere you don't have to lie down on the floor that means that you can even do it at your desk you could be standing up with your phone propped up and you can be doing standing abs and that's fantastic it also really helps works on your balance um, because you know there's lots of things that are just like one foot at a time so it's good for your balance it's amazing for your core lots of oblique work because we're doing side to side so standing abs is a great one to come back to if you're doing lots of other ab exercises come back to do standing abs every once in a while because it's really fun and it's really different and it just targets some different things and you know it's a great complement to what else you're doing okay so let's get going let's just start with like a nice little activation stretch arms overhead and give a nice reach pulling to one side pulling to the other side elongate your body very good and let's just put our hands on our thighs and let's do this little cat cow situation so we can put our head down and then breathe in arch your back Pull out breathe in Concentrate on activating your core. This is an ab workout. You want to really be cognizant of those abs that you've got down there. So this, there's a lot of balance also involved. So if you topple over, pick yourself back up and let's carry on. So we're going to start now with just slow high knees. Good. Just out in front, nice marching pace. Nothing too hard. Knees. So we'll do high knees and hold. Pull in. Fabulous. Other side. Keeping our balance. If you have a hard time with the balance, try to just find a point that you can kind of concentrate on. It helps. We'll go to the other side again.
then we're gonna go down, down, Don't do enough of this. Okay, now let's do a side crunch with our hands at our ears and same elbow, same knee. Okay, we'll start with eights, and then we're gonna add in some toe touches. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, 
let's add in some toe taps then. One, two, three, four, five. one angle and we'll just do some repeaters very good extend and pull in really do the crunching and let's go to the other side just doing abs on the floor all the time. So hope you enjoyed it and I look forward to seeing you the next time.